this video, we'll see how to reveal your subject in some creative ways in Adobe Premiere Pro. You can use this trick for transitions and the best part is, it's super simple to do. So without any further ado, let's get started. We'll be using this video in our first example. I have some ink or brush stroke clips here. You can download them if you want to follow along. Check the description for the download links. We'll be using this clip to reveal our subject. Now drag and drop it into our timeline. Select the bottom video which is our subject and apply the track matte key effect. Now go to effect controls. Our ink video is in video layer 2. So from the drop down select video 2. Now everything shows but if we select matte luma then we can see it's working now. When it is set to matte luma then the luminance value is considered. It's just like photoshop layer white shows and black heights. If you see the original video, you see those white brush strokes. Those areas are visible when it is set to matte luma. I have another ink video here. This is the opposite of the last one. Here we have black strokes starting to show on a white background. So if I drag and drop it and change the matte to video 3, then we get the opposite from what we want. If we reverse it, then we can see our subject. By the way, those black areas are transparent, not actually black. Now quickly see how the matte alpha works. Let's turn these layers off. I'll draw a rectangle at the top. It doesn't matter which color it is. Now set the matte to video 4 and select matte alpha. Only the rectangle areas will show. Of course you have the option to reverse it. When it is set to matte alpha, everything will show by that shape. It doesn't matter if it is black or white or a shape or a PNG logo. We can also use text. The process is exactly the same. Okay, as I mentioned earlier, those black areas are transparent. So we can place another video or any color below our main video layer. We can also use track matte key for transition. Let's use these two clips and this brush stroke to reveal the second video. Now place the first video just above the second video. I'll apply the track matte key effect in the first video. Select the video layer 3 and select matte luma and inverse it so that we can see the bottom layer. This transition is a little bit too long so we can speed it up. Now we have a nice transition between two videos. So this is how you can reveal something or use transition between two clips. I hope you enjoyed this video. Like, share and subscribe for more videos. Thanks for watching.